First up for our cadets is the one sixth chair. The next big NASA mission is Artemis, which plans to put people back on the moon for the first time in over 50 years. So if any of this lot want to be there, this will give them some much needed moonwalking practice. Space camp instructor Brian will take them through the first challenge of the week, one step at a time. So, does anyone want to take a guess on why it's called the one six chair? It reduces one six gravity. gravity. Yes, it is one six of Earth's gravity. So, you're gonna feel like you're walking on the moon. On the moon, we have three different types of movements that you can do. You're gonna do a bunny hop. You're gonna put your hands like a bunny because that's how it works. It gives you more speed and it makes you look a lot cooler. And you're just gonna bunny hop like this all the way down. And just in case you're thinking, who would bunny hop on the moon? The answer is Gene Cernan, the last man to walk on the moon in 1972. Take it away, Gene. Hippity hoppity, hippity hoppity, hippity hopping over hill and dale. Da -da 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 that looks like a load of fun, but this isn't just about having fun. Imagine if you weighed 36 kilos and suddenly you were just six kilos. That's what would happen if you went to the moon. So knowing how to get around would be really helpful. And then the last one, this is the really cool one. It's the slow motion run. This one is also the most difficult one because trying to push off with just one foot is not easy. And then after that, you can freestyle. <laughs> Beautiful. We have a small helmet and a medium helmet. If you have a small head, use a small helmet. If you have a medium head, use the medium helmet. And if you have a large head, use the medium helmet. <laughs> okay, give me a little test hop. All right, go ahead and bunny hop. You gotta do the hand, there you go. You gotta push yourself forward. All right. <laughs> what? Is... Not like a title swap. It was such a weird feeling being like one sixth of like your weight. Jumping was fine, but trying to actually move forward, that was a bit tricky because you just kept going up instead of forward. All right, go ahead, stand up. Honey. Whoa, why is everything so heavy all of a sudden, guys? <laughs> <laughs> Look at the way his feet land just on his tiptoes. Twinkle toes. You got this, be the bunny. Look at that motion, like she has it down. <laughs> felt really light and you felt like it was even hard to nearly push forward. You just kept, nearly kept going up all the time. <laughs> If I could jump that high in a J match, I'd be wicked good catching the ball. Oh, the glass is so weird. He's very speedy, very agile. Still doing the bunny hands. Oh. Oh. We're probably meant to do more serious walking, but jumping is a lot more fun. <laughs> <laughs> Are we going backwards? That way. <laughs> oh. 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 I think if I had a bit of practice, I could definitely wrap my head around, you know, microgravity, and uh, it was a really cool experience. Oh, yeah. How does it feel? That was so fun. Oh, it's really cool. How'd you find it? It's actually good. Yeah. It's weird. <laughs> the running part was so weird. Yeah, I <laughs> couldn't run. <laughs> you got this, Jack. Now, come on, man. Oh, yeah. Bangs far, bangs well. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Terrible hands. You need better hands, Jack. Come on. It, it was weird. It felt all right as if the force was coming from the bottom and that I was being pulled up rather than it just being spread around my whole body. That is the least comfortable chair I've ever sat in in my life. Hey, don't jump aside. Baby Mobile. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, I know. What the hell? Yeah. Don't be dramatic. <laughs> I'm not dramatic, bro. It's actually so. Oh, I'm blowing up. <laughs> I don't think that's how it works. One. <laughs> <laughs> this lot are all determined to get to the moon. <laughs> but Fintan has a particular dream for when he finally gets there. To perform some lunar karate kicks. He has a black belt, so they will look good. <laughs> when I was doing my karate kicks, I was thinking to myself, wouldn't it be the best, like, fail now or to be the first Irish person on the moon or the first person who cry kicks on the moon? 
All right, guys, cool. so how was it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah? You think it's easy to walk on the moon? No. Yeah. Do you think that you could do it? Yeah. 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 I, I think Ben has do it. the best run, not going to lie. I swear. Yeah, it was per it was beautiful. Are you sarcastic? No, no, it's beautiful. No, it was good. It actually was good. What can I say? Brian, the instructor, said that my run was the best one with the karate kicks and everything. So, I mean, that was a great way to start off the challenge. So I was delighted with that.